Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Chloe and I'm a Disney collector from the UK, but I also do lots of other Disney musical theatre and the odd equestrian bits and pieces over on this channel. Now today is a Primark and HMV haul which I acquired from my trip from when I just went solo over to Southampton. If you have not seen that vlog, I will leave a card up above. It was a very big day for me, so I'm extremely proud of the fact that I did it. Um, so I do apologise if you did find the last vlog a little bit boring, but I hope that you will enjoy this one. So I think what I'll do, I will start with Primark. So when I went to Primark, I was actually really surprised about actually how little I bought. I was very good. Um, but the first thing I want to show you are these. I thought these were absolutely gorgeous. Um, Converse's, obviously they are from Primark, so they are not actual brand of Converse. They are just in the style. On the outside, you have Mickey, 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 Mickey. <laughs> and on the inside, it is just the plain cream with the red, lining around the bottom um i love these i thought these were really nice i am a size five so obviously i got them in a size five um and i thought these were really good these were actually only believe it or not 12 pounds so i actually thought win-win and i just i love them they are so they're almost quite simplistic, but I just really like the design. So yes, I was really pleased when I found these. Um, and yeah, they just had to go in my basket. I love them. So 12 pound. They are cream, so I'm gonna have to wait until the weather dries up a little bit to wear them. But if I go out somewhere nice, then I will probably wear them then. Next up, I've already opened it, but it is this, I'll put it back together, it is this phone set cases of a Slinky Dog from Toy Story 4, so it says on this one, together forever, and then together forever, so I'm guessing you can give it to like, if you both got, I've got an iPhone 11, so obviously this is an iPhone 11, um, but if you've both got one, then I'm guessing that you could have like, almost matching. Um, I'm using this one currently. Um, I like the fact, I like the effect it's got here. Um, it is like sort of rubber plasticky. But um, yes, I really like that. I've been looking for a new phone case for quite a while. And this set it was actually only £5. So I don't think I could really go wrong there. Next, I picked this up on, literally, it was the last item I picked up, and that was this. It is a planner with a pen. You get a little pen with it. Um, I was really impressed because, like, inside, this is what it looks like. So you've got, obviously, the days of the week, the month. You can circle what month it is, and it's just, I think it's such a good little handy thing to have, like, to put in like your bag like if you need to like make notes of like appointments and things because i don't normally do that i have like a main diary that i write in but i don't have like one that goes and carries around with me um in the back you've got quite a few note pages which i really really like um and yeah i was really pleased with this because it's actually quite a spongy i always thought good quality kind of material and I've already taken the label off of it but it was only £2.50 so I didn't think I could go wrong with that either you know even if I didn't get much use out of it it's a little clicky pen um and yeah I think I will actually get quite a lot of use out of it so next is a Harry Potter item itchy eye um I bought this Hufflepuff paddle brush nice hair brush um i really like this obviously i am of course in the hands of hufflepuff you have got the badger as the emblem and you've got this this is the design down the handle um 
I just really liked it. This was £3.50. Again, I literally took all this out of the wrapper, like, on the boat home yesterday. But, yes, I really like it. I love a paddle brush, and I just think they're so useful. Um, just to pop in your bag and... But yes, no, I really liked it. And like I say, it was Hufflepuff. It was the last one, so it would have been rude not to, right? Next is this. I bought this. This is not Disney or anything. This is plainly, it is a little reindeer scrunchy. It's really fluffy, cute, and you've got little antlers here. Um, obviously, it's coming up to Christmas, um, and I just wanted something nice because I always have my hair up. And this was two pound um but i really liked it and i just thought do you know what for christmas i think that'd be nice to have in my hair something a bit different okay so on to clothing um the first piece of clothing i got was these they are the christmas pajamas it is a long sleeve and trouser set um i got these in a size 14 to 16. i am not 14 16 i comfortably sit in size 12 but um i always find that primark sizes come up a bit smaller than actually what the label says so i always go for a large and also because where i live on the isle of wight my primark is in southampton so if i needed to return anything i would have to get on the boat and like it would actually cost more than the item itself so I try and estimate what sizes I'm gonna need to make sure I get the right size. So yes, this was a size 14 to 16. I really love the print. Um, it's almost got like the vintage mini on here. Um, and these ones, they were 10 pound, um, which I really wanted some nice new Christmas PJs for this year. For the looks of it, they've got like the drawstring on the trousers. Um, and yes, and apparently it is made using sustainable cotton. Um, normally, I suppose you can get pajama sets in Primark for about eight, eight pound, and these were ten. So, didn't make much difference to me. I really liked them, so that was fine. Okay, so next up were these. I bought these. These were actually in the pajama section. They are Winnie the Pooh. Pajama trousers, I thought these were really cute. The material is super soft. Um, on it, it says, sometimes the smallest things take up the most room in your heart. And it, it has got poo and piglet on swing. Um, and yes, I really like these. Again, I got these in size 14 to 16. Um, just because, like I say, sizing. They've got the elastic around the ankles and it is elastic around the waist. And these were, again, these were £10. And again, they're made, from, made using sustainable fibres. So I just thought they were really cute. And as soon as I saw that, I was like, yeah, they'll be nice and snuggly and they look nice. Okay, something else that I've also already taken out of the packet. Ah, <laughs> I put these on last night because my feet were really cold. So, hang on, let me put them on the right way. <laughs> Is these, oh no, I've done it wrong. Hang on. Bear with. Right. Got it. Okay, so it was these socks. They are really nice material. They are Disney. They have got rubber on the bottom to stop me slipping on things like tiles. And it has poo on the cuff. Um, you can roll them down. You can have them up. Um, I really like these. I think these were about £3. Um, but I just really liked the material. So I thought, you know, you can't go wrong. And I always need woolly socks because my feet are constantly cold okay so surprisingly that is all i got from primark don't ask me how that happened but i had the like best surprise yesterday because i walked as i was on my way to primark i was walking up and on my left i saw it and i was like no it can't be hmv 
a new brand new store opened yesterday yeah i was one of the first in it brand new hmv store in southampton it's huge as well it's not just like a little store like i know we have one on the island which wasn't that big this one is huge and it has expanded so much not only does it do music dvds you can also get lots of film and tv merch from it they do funkos now um mugs loads of different merchandise and also they had i think it was like american japanese like food drinks things like that so of course i went into there because this is me and of course i went straight to the musical theater soundtracks because as you know if you've watched my vlog before i love musical theater i try to go to the theater as much as i can so i picked up some soundtracks that i didn't have already so the first one i was really chuffed because i think this was only released yesterday as well and that was Samantha Barks' album called Into the Unknown. Now, if you don't know who Samantha Barks is, no, you should. <laughs> she plays Elsa currently on the West End. She is who I saw when I went up to see it in September. Um, if you've not seen that vlog, I will leave a card up above. Um, she has also been in Les Miserables. So she was in the film with Hugh Jackman and on here it's got a collection it's all musical theater and disney styled songs taken from the likes of obviously she's done a frozen song maybe quite maybe like hints in the title which one she did um great shaman moana mulan dear Evan hansen smash all them sort of musicals she has done a compilation of music which i think is absolutely amazing this cd was $12.99 um but I love her voice I always have done she's got an amazing voice so it was worth every penny next one up is a Disney album and it is The Lion King now I was due to see The Lion King last September at the Mayflower Theatre but due to this horrible virus going around it got moved and moved and moved so now it, i am now seeing it next september which generally in my life now feels like a mile away it feels so long um so i treated myself to this my favorite song on the cd is they live in you i love that song it's just so disney likes african and i love the african style music um this one was 9.99 um and it is of the original broadway cast recording um so yes very chuffed with that next one i don't know if you have seen or heard of it but i'm hoping you have by now and that is i got the brand new cinderella cast recording from the west end um, this is Andrew Lloyd Webber's brand new musical. He has been working on it for a while and it is starring the gorgeous Carrie Hope Fletcher. And I mean the gorgeous Carrie Hope Fletcher. She's incredible. She is on this album. She sings Bad Cinderella. She's actually playing Cinderella, believe it or not. Um, I've only listened to two songs off this album and there are... 17 all together including the finale so i'm very excited to put this on um if you haven't heard of it or listened to it already please get onto youtube and have a listen because it is incredible and as you know where it's android weather you know the music is going to be pretty good um last um musical theater soundtrack that i bought i absolutely love this musical and it is the original cast from the original film and that is of Annie now I love Annie I love the music in it I saw the musical a couple of years ago now with Craig Rebel Hallwood from Strictly Come Dancing as Miss Hannigan um, and it's amazing I just Miss Hannigan's an incredible character so when she did like little girls I just loved it um, this one was a lot cheaper than the others that I picked up and it was only $5.99 um, probably because it is quite an old 
soundtrack. Now the last two ones I bought was Christmas presents. But my mum um, knows that this has been picked up for her. Um, and I highly doubt if my dad watches these videos. So if he does, then he's going to know. Um, for my mum, this is what she asked for for Christmas. It is Earth, Wind and Fire Gold. It has got three CDs of all their like famous hits um i love earth wind and fire too um my mum actually asked for the cd for christmas she, she said please pick up this cd while you're over there if you can hear a dog barking please excuse me that's my bonnie um so yes i did this one was only 5.99 and it is actually a gift from my dad to my mum but he doesn't know it yet now the one I picked up for my dad, and that is the final item of this haul, and that is the new Elton John CD. Now I love Elton John, I do. Um, it is the Lockdown Sessions, it's called, and it is collaborations with some of the world's famous artists from Dua Lipa, um, Charlie Puth, Years and Years, um uh, Miley Cyrus um Gorillas but yes so all of them amazing artists have been collaborated with Elton John on this CD um my dad I, I was in the car the other day and dad said he loved it and he, said he really wanted to get it so fingers crossed he does not purchase this album before Christmas day um, this one was $10.99 um, as it is a brand new release. They are normally around between £10 and £12. But anyway, that is it. Guys, I have picked up loads of stuff. Obviously, Primark stuff you cannot get online um, because it's not really annoying. I wish we could get online Primark stuff. Um, but for everything else i will leave links down below especially for the cds um thank you so much for watching if you like this video please hit the like button as it really does help me out subscribe to see all my future stuff thank you so much for watching and i'll see you again soon bye